Hey, 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 dear Empath HSB. Uh, I wanted to record this coaching video for you right now uh, about the topic of being a God's chosen one, um, Earth Angel Starseed. If you identify as being one, that you are this combination. Uh, and that is also what I am. So I'm happy to have you here, you know, of course, following me in my work and being my client. And so I want to give you support and, and guidance and understanding as always uh, my encouragement and empathy with this topic so that you can actually, you know, accept yourself and, and love yourself the way you are and not be pretending to be someone else. Because that is, you know, how your life should be. How can you ever, you know, feel feel your life purpose? How can you ever really love yourself if you're always pretending to be somebody else? If you're always pleasing other people? Uh, if you're always, you know, wearing this mask, like I've been talking about this before, uh, just a while ago. But yeah, so... I want to give you encouragement that if you are also on social media making videos like what I'm doing and people are commenting negatively to you. So remember that, you know, it's not it's not ever, ever, ever your responsibility to be reacting to those comments or, you know, engaging with them, because uh, as always, this is also a boundary lesson that you need to be able to protect yourself from that energy, from that person, and, you know, to be able to set your boundaries, to have your powerful voice, because, you know, apparently, as, as God, as a God's chosen one, um, as an empath, they just be, you know, we can stir a lot of opinions and, and, you know, people's negative energies, but it's not our problem, it's, it's not, our issue to be dealing with that we have better things to do <laughs> such as our life purpose you know like what I'm doing here with my work so we have that 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 better purpose for our precious energy and time and um, attention and, and care and all of that so I want to be an example to you about this you know if you need support and and encouragement and that is why you're here but yeah so this can happen uh like what i was talking about last night uh when i felt that i just wanted to record that video about it what happened but you know um of course we always should also turn it into a positive because we are alchemists we turn things you know, negative things into positive things. And we have overcome a lot in our lives. So we can do that, but we just have to believe in ourselves, you know, and, and see it and feel it and, and sense it that, okay, I can do this. That it does not matter what somebody thinks of me or, or comments on my social media profile or, you know, whatever on my post or on my video, that's their issue. It's not my issue to carry. And I just recorded a short reels uh, saying <laughs> that, you know, only small minds criticize and judge others. So, you know, we, we people, we, we, come, we come to this world, we, there are different ages, there are different races, there are different characteristics we we all have a life story and opinions and, and rights and we all have a voice and we all should have a powerful voice to use for good things and especially as a sensitive empath they just be you are so needed in this world so i don't ever want you to be ashamed of yourself anymore when you can see it from this positive the stronger angle that you can see your strength and you can know that, okay, I can turn this into a positive and nobody should ever care about, you know, what somebody thinks or says, you know, because it always says about them, not you. 
and it depends on if they see it from a positive or a negative angle and that and again that's their issue that's out of your control because that's their mindset that's their problem or issue or whatever you know that is showing up in their behavior like i was saying yesterday for example again but yeah so <sighs> As people we we can have you know so much life experience and um, there are children there are old people there are you know different uh, backstories you know backgrounds you know we should just love it all we should love and care for one another and that is of course the big mission of us empires and just peace and God's chosen ones earth angel star seeds you know but we just have to discover our life path, our, our, you know, our strength and all of that. And that is where I come in if you want my help and support. And that is why you're here. So thank you. But do consider booking a call with me if you need someone to talk to who will really get you and listen to you and encourage you. Because, of course, uh, <laughs> that is my main point of being me is that I'm so encouraging. I was always encouraging my friends and, and you know, people around me and it, it comes so naturally to me and I just love it. But yeah, but anyway, big signs that you are a God's chosen one or an earth angel star seed is that you've been through a lot in your life, a lot of pain, a lot of turmoil, a lot of abuse. Usually you're born into a toxic family and you have to endure bullying in your childhood as well physical emotional spiritual uh, mental abuse and of course this can be very 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 difficult to deal with and to heal from and you can see angel numbers uh, very very often for example you can work with angels you're called to doing spiritual work healing work you're a natural healer you have a big heart you have this natural compassion intuitive empathy towards other people you sense other people's energies you are an empath they just be and you feel like you're very different from others likely you never really found your place in this world and you're still looking and you're still wondering about things and searching for answers but uh, of course the key is to connect with god we have to be able to connect with god and to pray to meditate to tune in daily to have that own space for ourselves to be able to be calm and peaceful so that we can gather our thoughts and emotions you know together peacefully and not not be triggered by the outside world so this is very important self-care uh, tip as a sensitive empath and just be as a God's chosen one uh, earth angel star seed because we need to have that own personal time and space for ourselves every single day and you have this 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 wisdom you have this divine intelligence and power and strength this this amazing beautiful superpower within you that is meant to be used for good things naturally and you can easily care about nature, you, you care about animals, you care about children, you care about people generally. You never ever ever wish anything bad for anyone, <laughs> but you can end up suffering in the process if you end up being a people pleaser. So this is of course a trap that you have to pay attention to, uh, to avoid you know stop being stop being the people pleaser and you know instead just become empowered and uh embrace that that life mission and everything that you are embracing your soul blueprint that you have signed you know before you were born into this world but these are big signs that you are this divine being 
and you are meant for big things in this world you're meant to be heard and unseen and, and uh you know people come to you for help and support and encouragement and compassion and you easily care you easily love people you can easily you know maybe fall in love with people um you just you, you see the good things in others naturally which is of course uh not always uh also it's not always of course healthy when uh you have to also be protecting yourself of course from trusting uh the wrong people again but yeah so you have to work on your boundaries you have to work on you know getting to know yourself and discovering your identity and your life purpose your life mission but again this is where i come in because i can help with all of this if you're open to it but yeah so yeah maybe likely you've been almost killed that can also be a big sign because naturally the evil forces don't want us here they don't want us here and that is why we get bullied we get attacked we get criticized we get um that emotional mental physical abuse psychic attacks and, and all of that because we shine our light you shine your light and the evil forces don't want you to be alive they don't want you to be here being you and, and doing your work and, and healing the world and helping others and, and sharing kindness and compassion and understanding but the world needs it of course that is why we're here that is why you're still here alive today watching this video so i hope that you can just be grateful to be able to wake up, you know, tell yourself, hey, good morning, I love me. What great things could I to do today? What, what great could I create today? What amazing things could I do for myself today, for example? Or maybe you wanna create some music, maybe you wanna sing and dance and, you know, raise your vibration, connect with your angels. Maybe you wanna pray meditate move your body you know whatever feels good for you right now today but of course we need those high vibe practices that is what we need so it is important to have those every single day because it's also a big way to take care of yourself but yeah and in short this is <clears throat> what what a god's chosen one earth angel star seed is so you just have a big heart and you know you just care about people and sense people's energies and um maybe you're wondering like what can i do with this what can i do with my gifts and i know how that feels like because i've also gone through this and i'm just here to help you and support you and to remind you that you don't need to care about those haters and and those people who try to attack you because we just have to be strong we have to stay stay on our life mission on our life purpose what we have signed up for so it's not anything to be wasted it's not anything to be you know given to the wrong people who don't value it so of course we deserve those people around us who actually uplift us and, and support us you know because those people are out there there are lots of good good amazing smart kind people out there even though it seems like there are not but it's not true there are those people but it's a lonely path it's, it's a very very lonely path and this used to be a big pain point for me that uh, i always felt like an outcast but yeah so if you're feeling like an outcast right now just remember that you know you're not alone <laughs> for example i'm here to support you and you know i just want to remind you to love yourself and to accept yourself even though things aren't not always easy. Things are definitely not easy when you are this person. 
but you have a reason to be here. So I don't want you to be giving up. And especially if somebody random is trying to bring you down, it's just it's just a reminder that this person has issues and they are showing it by commenting negatively. They are seeking your care and, and empathy and love and attention because their inner child is wounded and they just want your attention at that moment. And especially if you are uh, setting your boundaries with others, uh, it's very common apparently that you can get attacked like like yesterday i just uploaded the video and within an hour this this hater wanted to try to bring me down when all i want to do is encourage my people to rise up so naturally uh it doesn't feel good to me when i notice it and even though i know that i you know of course i need to ignore it but anyway i'm <laughs> I'm not a robot like you are not either. We have feelings. As sensitive beings, we have deep feelings and thoughts and emotions. So naturally, it will stir, stir up something within you, you know? But of course, we can also practice uh, having that powerful mindset to protect ourselves so that we don't have to, we don't have to care. We don't have to notice basically at all. But anyway, it's just another reminder that, you know, how ironic this can be that we can get these attacks from these people, which is so unnecessary, but apparently it just happens. And it's not something that we want, but it's something that we might have to deal with uh, every now and again, apparently. But yeah, so as always, I'm here to support you. So uh, I don't want you to be suffering because of these, you know, if people are attacking you, like what has happened to me all my life. Um, it's, it's just something that, you know, we just have to be dealing with in our own way. But yeah, so anyway, I just wanted to... Uh, give you this this guidance and um uh <laughs> sort of a sort of like a coaching video uh with my thoughts right now that you know keep doing it if you are also on social media uh helping others keep doing it because that's what you're supposed to do like what i'm doing here so if you work with angels or you know the spiritual realm like I do, then you know all the better. You know, <laughs> I really praise you. You know, just keep doing it. We have to believe in ourselves. We are here to help. You know, we are here to be channels for the divine, and we must stay on that path of of light and peace and love.